right now, we got the Battle of the Giants, Drake on the Giant, Andre the Giant. You can stop clapping Who's now. Who's the true giant? Get over it! <laughs> the streak will live on forever in my heart. We got a match bigger than the streak. We've got the immovable object against the immovable object. Oh, there's Drake on the giant and his nasty singlet. Classic singlet for all giants. Yeah, he's standing in the ring, and now he's standing in the ring. Eminem on stage driving him to the ring. Of course he is. We flew him all to Japan, every band. You didn't fly me to Japan. And here comes the Wildcat! Yeah. <laughs> Andre the I, Giant! I had to ride on a boat over here. Look at that singlet! Classic Andre singlet. Vintage Andre, if you will. Sure. You could. Do you know where Andre was, Duel? And do you know where he is now? I think he was in the ring, but now he is in the ring. I thought you were going to say you, he's yes. from France. No. So how much I know. Here we go. Battle of the Big Men, finally. Whoa. What does, and we see arm work in a match with Giants. What, do we, what does Duel know about France? Absolutely A lot. Nothing. See, there you go. Under the Absolutely Giant. Absolutely a lot. Drake on the Giant. Is the word giant on the the line, just like the letter T was on the line in WCW? Perhaps. I never thought of that. <laughs> Look at this arm work. If only there was a booker who could have thought of the things that they both have in their name. Sort of like Eleven Side coming out at Eleven. If only... Oh, oh come on! Jeez. Dick. Where's the TQ? Dick Q. Who do you got in this one, guys? I gotta give the advantage the to fans. Andre. The fans will win. Yeah, you can't vote against the Wildcat. Oh, God. Okay, well, since you can't vote against Andre, I'll vote for Dracon. Why? Is it because he's black? Why? Does Jeremax hate blacks? I mean, <laughs> they, they, they've gainfully employ a racist. Yeah, his name is Dual. Critical Super. Oh, my God. Incredible of the show of power. That wasn't a swinging neckbreaker. And now the giant choking out the giant. Use first names, you dimwit. Right. Oh, Andre went for a low blow. The Wildcat is crazy. Leg sweep and an elbow right to the inner thigh. Oh, don't work the knees of the Wildcat, Roar. He's old and nimble. And old brittle. Went for a bear hug. <laughs> Andre be nimble. Ow. Andre be quick. Andre steps on top of a candlestick. Rawr. Because he's a sure. wildcat. Throws off Drake on the ropes. Oh, he went for a dropkick. He missed. He put all his weight into that dropkick and failed. He, well, what bad luck. I don't know how much energy he could have left. I can't even do a dropkick. This, this is true. Oh, fake the out. tapes. Oh. What the? Oh, God. Luther's <laughs> press does not get a... What the fuck was that? If he had done that to any other man, they would have been out and pinned. Dracon was happy to be able to breathe oxygen after being squashed under Andre the Giant's leathery scrotum. <laughs> no kidding. I, I bet you never thought you'd say his, that, Slip. His peanuts were in his mouth. Played cards against humanity, so yes, I have said it before duel. Uh, More uh, work in the arm. Oh, smart strategy neutralizes oh. the choke slam. Oh. Avalanche attack. Showing off. Dracon showing his strength. He's not strong. He's just pretending to. To psych out a wildcat. Oh, it's not show. Strong. oh no! No strength there. Seven oh. feet in the air on one hand. And seven feet down. Oh, oh. he's back up. And he's about to go right one. back to where he was. And seven feet straight to hell. Come on, wildcat! That's Kick gotta out. be one, it. Two, three. Ah, the giant, the true giant of Jeremax. Drake on the giant with an impressive win over the Wildcat here at Jeremania. Andre the regular guy. The Wildcat has been put down. One giant, and it's Drake on. Dominant display. I really can't deny that. He really did dominate the Wildcat here tonight. Maybe he was right all along. Of course he was. And of course I was. But everyone loves the Wildcat, like his best friend Alberto Del Rio. That's exactly what Andre should do. He should admit that he Why? is... Why? Yeah. 
He's got a point. That's the most coherent thing on has ever said, but he is, <laughs> does not have a point. So basically, Dracon just has to get a chainsaw and chop off Andre's legs. <laughs> Andre really doesn't care! Andre's shaking it off like it was nothing! This Wait a minute! This after-the-match altercation is completely unnecessary. Hip what toss! Who's that standing outside the ring, by the way? That's, That's Alberto Del Rio, Team, team Street Wee, bro! Oh wait! Happy Bomb! Happy Bomb connects! That was very happy. Why does everyone want to go get milkshakes? Oh, can I have a milkshake? Can you bring one out here? Oh! oh Splash! I don't think you want a Japanese milkshake duel. Oh. Ah. Uh, I guess uh, we're gonna go hang out with uh, Rachel and Don Bronchitis getting milkshakes. Ah. Uh. He may have lost, but the Wildcat stands tall of our Dracon. This is disgusting. Dracon won, and there was an unprovoked assault after the match. Andre should be fired. Call him a French chaperone fuck. versus chaperone. We, who's the real giant? Who's more like who's the real chaperone? Clearly, penis. Penis chaperone against Triple H. Oh God. Coming to you live from inebriation land. <laughs> Yeah, well, you get what you paid for. You paid for them? I hear. I <laughs> flew them over here. I hear inebriation land is loveliest time of the year. Triple H, single G. No, he's back Whoa. to Triple H. Oh, oh nice camera work. <laughs> Triple H wants to prove that he is the true chaperone. I hope he can prove whether or not he's standing in the ring. Hardcore title on the line. Oh. He's standing on the apron, <laughs> oh. and he's between the ropes! All right, who's ready? <laughs> Who is ready for some shield tripping? And here comes a penis chaperone! The hardcore champion! I know Jules looking forward to possibly seeing one, maybe two, or three penisers! You know how much I love seeing penis -er. I'm sure there are clubs in Japan full of penisers. Three-time hardcore champion, leader of the shield trip! Penis chaperone who's probably happy that the anti WWE crusade is falling apart, right, Slip? I'm sure Penis Chaperone is happy, but that was an emotional moment with Lucas Gomez earlier tonight. If you missed it, it was a great moment. You should go back and watch it. Everyone was everyone was on their feet. Everyone. Everyone matters to Slip was on their feet. Which is me. Oh, oh no. illegal in a hardcore match. Suck it up, Slip, we got a match to commentate. I'll suck up the penis -er. I wonder what kind of toys the hardcore fans brought here in Japan. Oh, it blocked Well, they brought a giant pepper shaker for Colton earlier. And there's half, half a table. table. <laughs> it's, a, it's a Japanese table, so it won't break. Vertical suplex! Swing it over his head. Oh, God! Oh! And Penis hit Triple H with some wood. Now, Triple, Triple H has some wood for Penis. And a nightstick. I believe that's a, a nightstick. Oh, oh my geez. God! Is that where he wants the nightstick put? Possibly! Psyching out the penis chaperone! And now Triple H has the nightstick! He's gonna be serving some hard time! Confirm to everyone in, in the crowd tonight that there is no Klingons on the moon. Okay. Triple H get out of the way there, but gets hit the second time. Watch the third! Grabs the leg, takes Duel him down. clearly not getting my commentary. No. I'm not a nerd, so. <sighs> Wait a minute! Flare bump! Oh. Triple H knows Flare better than anyone! It's true. Now Triple H taking advantage. Could not dodge that! No! Oh, that line took him inside out. Lariato! We are in Japan. Now Penis fighting back or not? Jeez, Triple Trading H! Trading jabs. Could be moments away from being the hardcore chaperone. Triple H definitely look, trying to become the new king of strong style. Will Ray Bradstone win? Who? He just wants to be in his daughter's life. There's the other half of the table. Well, there you go. If you if you put the table together, is it like Exotica and you like Exotica? win the match immediately? Exotica, exactly. <laughs> I still decide the thin one. I don't understand these references these children make today. <laughs> Jesus! Oh my god! On the back of the neck of the penis chaperone. I like the Exoticide better. 
Oh, he's the best mod on CU. Slip. He's the best mod on CU ever. He has penis chaperone trapped in between the steps. He's got Current a two by four. Included. Oh. Oh my god, he just got wood! Sure. I already Cock made that joke. Cock blocked! I didn't Did make that, that one. one. Oh, oh my. How is he not busted open? <laughs> he was staring right at it. Oh, oh god! Thank you. Got that flapjack. Oh, through it. Oh, flapjack. <laughs> oh no! So the Japanese fans appear to have brought the exact same weapons you'd get at any other show. Love their. They want to live the Jeremax gimmick. I was hoping that they'd have a giant rock book, but apparently they don't. They so might. How them. do you feel about Triple H being in jeans, Slip? Oh. Uh, serious fucking business. Of course. This is hardcore street fight. Dress as you come. <laughs> well. Oh, what a knee! Oh, triple H knee! That famous running it. knee! That famous running knee! Vintage duel. Where's Wait, he? what's Venus oh, doing out here? He's... Come on! He's luring him! Look for the baseball slide, I guess. Caught well, nothing of it. By that. Oh! Whoa! Telling him and to suck it. And he uses Triple H's own signature taunt. Uh, and, uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh. This is about to get very personal. Get your vocal cords ready, duel! <laughs> They're always Could ready. Could we see it? Right in front of our faces. Oh. Nope! Oh my god! Oh, pedigree! Pedigree! Pedigower! I guess. Good thing Undertaker took all that diet, too! It's Triple H now. The only yes. diet with doing it? The only do with diets in it. The only duel with diet in it. This could be it! A pedigree! On top of that table. nightstick? I would drink a diet mountain. No, What's up with a nightstick? Penisar! Oh god, a penis are right on the nightstick. Gonna look for the cover. Nobody's gonna get up. Is absolutely it. One, two, That's and three. Penis, penis chaperone right. defends the hardcore title successfully here at Jeremania. What a One brutal. true chaperone. One title defense successful for the Shield Troop. And a great There's another replay. one to come. Let's see this great replay of the pin. What a pin. Look at the way he covers him! Look at that! That, that is that is fantastic form. Who is this? Wait a minute. Who is that? Who is this man? That... Who is this man? He's got some bad luck for you. That's... Oh my god, it's Bad News Barrett! That's Bad Luck Folly! Bad Luck Folly? What okay. on earth is he doing I'm here? i my headset. Well, it's 24-7 hardcore title rules. Oh god, no! Is he even employed? And we're in Japan. I don't even know if he's employed! Oh no! He calls this the Bad Luck Fall! Bad Luck Fall! No way! One, two... And we have a new and, and court Bad Luck Fall! Fale has invaded Jeremax! I don't believe it! His glasses are on! Whoa, whoa. Let's see the bad... This is a real replay! A real replay! A bad luck fall. Unexpected debut. Hey, there was rumors. Jeremax may have signed a famous Japanese talent. Oh, that's true. But those rumors. I thought the only rumors was about you and Steven Santos leaving a Japanese love hotel. My God, bad luck fall. Eh? Well, there's Danielle Bryan in the back with uh, Yuna. And the EVP of talent deflation, Deborah. Apparently Frollo's not talking to anyone here tonight. Well, he's gotta get himself ready for his match. Pac-Man really uh, laid it thick on him on the pre-show, bitching him yes, out. Yes, the pre-show. Exactly. Can Frollo somehow stop this? Or are we doomed to die? Like that man did, Jert Angle. Like that man, El Jefe. El Jefe was in the right, Jert Angle. Crying about not having sex. Come on, he's his best friend. Here okay. comes Al Heaven. Not the live performance. I hate, I hate how you do that. Oh. WrestleMania gear. Cuban penile crisis gear. WrestleMania gear, whatever. He's trying to get into the head of Jordan Angle by wearing their tag gear. Clearly. He just wants to be friends with Jordan Angle. Jordan Angle's the one who's starting all this. He 
He fought Frollo and brought Jert back to life, and Jert isn't appreciative. Okay. Well, I'm sure Jert found some peace, although this guy's kind of an asshole. He doesn't leave a very good phone message. Well, you know what? Listen up, knucklehead. I'm just hoping that Jert Ankle can be... You, you know, know what? Ever, ever since... Ever since Pyro Rumble, this has been my, one of my favorite superstars in Jeromax. Oh, ever since he died. Wow, you're a real oh. great guy, Slip. Too soon. It sucks to see best friends like this fight. We already gotta watch Johnny and Homer later. Now this? It's too much! This could be the last day of their lives. They gotta spend it together. But no, because he got pulled away from sex with demons. We have to have this. Well, I guess they are spending it together as opponents. It Oh, shut up. Get to the fight already. I Come on, I agree with Hefe. How do we know that's even Hefe? That's a good point. El Hefe trying to talk some sense into Jerk. Oh, he's going to get counted out right oh, now. Oh, not more milk milkshakes. Oh, my. Yeah, that's right, coward. When it's over, Jerk Angle wins by count out. We're going uh, to 20. 20 count. We're in Japan. Why are we going to 20? We're in Japan. Oh, God damn it. Don't give away the ending of the match or anything. He could still get in there. Are you kidding me? Good, bros before hoes. I admire Hefe. Really good hoes. I admire Hefe. I guess Jert's success. Uh, oh, Jert doesn't look too happy. That's that's definitely not vengeance. Good. That's definitely it's not what we're probably just gonna piss him off even more. Oh. <gasps> What? Wait a minute, the Mapacha! Jerd Angle? Lizard? Is he the vanguard of this lizard conspiracy? Apparently he is. So all this behavior is anger over Hefe was really because he's a lizard? Uh, maybe. Save out chops. Well, yeah, Deborah said if they don't find the lizards, he's gonna fire them. Oh, come on! Don't. What? That's oh. not Jert Angle, it's a lizard! You were asking if that was the real Hefe, is this the real Jert? Just what's there... going on? Wait Here a comes minute! El Hefe! Hefe, run into Samus! Is that the real Hefe? Hefe driver! Hefe's a lizard, it's confirmed! Someone text Maltzer! Oh, and another L! Hefe driver! The Mapacha are insane! <laughs> Hefe and Jert aren't lizards! They've been here for years! What is going on? Lizards have a very long life lifespan. It's very clear, Duel. These two guys are fighting these other two guys because two people are confusing them with lizards. What else do you think is going on? So, so you don't think they're lizards? They are lizards! There are no lizard people! Yes, there are! I, gu I guarantee you, you will find out before the night's over that these two, or at least there are lizards in Jeromax. I am so You're lost. insane. Four oh, the 90 miles, 450 splash. And Moto and Maji Pacha, their careers may be done right here. Well, they just formed into one bio. Are <laughs> they a new liberal? Sure, it does not look too good. But maybe this knocked a little sense into him. Kidding. It does take a little bit of slapping around to make a, a lizard realize what's going on. It makes sense when you think about it. No, no human could have beat uh, or the king Mad Eye Cornet Spire Rumble. It had to be a lizard. Don't tell me you're buying into this conspiracy. I, it's starting to make a whole lot more sense. Oh, they're gonna have at, least, at least we're gonna get a oh, happy Jesus. ending tonight. Are we? Th we could all die before the night's over, Duel. Yeah, well, at least they get to go bang gutter sluts. Japanese gutter sluts. <laughs> and the music of the Cuban Pinot Crisis confirms the best friends are back together! Is oh, that what that confirms? All it took was a sure. lizard person. <laughs> Oh god. One of the most dominant females in professional wrestling today. This will be today. shorter than the last match, no kidding. Mitnik is the most dominant champion of all time. So, do I watch this or do I go get my breakfast burritos now?
Just watch the match. Alright, fine. But I'm telling you, this is gonna be quicker than the 20 second match we had last. <sighs> well, she has some very there's inspirational Lamorel's music. Lady. Ginger wants to find the eye of the tiger and become women's champion. Well, first she has to find the inside of the ring. Not the eye of the tiger, the right or the kaiser. Push comes to shove, she did pull out that insane Bahrain Buster. That, that music was pretty weird. If she could do it again, she could be women's champion. But my god, here comes Whitney. Do you see a live performance of whatever this is? No, we don't. Oh. You need to get your ears checked. I can't afford sorry, that I miss, many. I miss Lucas Gomez. I just want to start clapping again. No! This woman yeah. deserves. Well, this woman does deserve an applause, but we'll save it for after this very short does, match. Does she deserve any diet Mountain Dew? Somebody better get ready to send this to World Star. Sure. Cause this is gonna be brutal. The only diet with diet in it. Start the clock, ladies and gentlemen. Only two One Mississippi. Mississippi. It's Whitney and Mississippi. Ginger. Mississippi. Please don't Three count. Three Mississippi. Call the moves, please. <laughs> Jesus, he punched the shit out of her. <laughs> Ginger, who was not trained by anyone. Lamorel wouldn't train her. Danielle wouldn't train her. Grandma Gower was gonna train her, but got injured. Poor Grandma Gower. Now she's Gower. all on her own. Couldn't be here tonight. It's too bad. Broken neck? <laughs> what the hell was that? She also actually has three warrants up for her arrest in Japan. You don't want to know why. I kind of do. Well, it involves you and Steven Santos. Kind of don't. <laughs> Bit neat now, working the leg of Ginger. Ginger, Ginger getting oh, decimated. God. Right in the face. Well, it has gone past 20 seconds for what that's worth. Well, Whitney's probably just dragging it out because she wants to beat up Ginger. Probably. Ginger, whoa. Well, that really didn't well, go uh, very you got far. It. She's trying, guys. Well, she caught the kick and oh. see the enziguri. And it looks like... Oh my god, this is just, she's just gonna play around with Ginger. That might actually cost her if she slips up. Hey! Ginger just will not stay I'm down, though. I'm for people fucking themselves. Congratulations to me. Does Ginger have she the eye of the tiger? Oh, well, she cut the ropes. She gets a good collar Wait and elbow. Wait a minute! She gonna oh. She's gonna oh, oh my god! Almost. Oh, vertical suplex denied! Almost. Is he Whitney knew that you guys were going to call the vertical suplex spot and not me. If she knew it was me, she would have let it happen. Whitney was ready oh. to retire because she's beating everyone. Turned into and a sleeper. sleeper hold. But then Ginger said, no, I want to challenge her for the title, and she laughed at Ginger. Speaking of sleeper holds, this match. Well, oh, I mean, it's just a one-sided beatdown. Wait a minute. No. Oh, and oh my god, denied again. <laughs> Ginger can't oh. get any offense going. No, Poor she Ginger. cannot. But she's not giving up! Uh, gotta give her credit for that, she's I guess. She's got heart. She... Give her that. She's an idiot. With Lamorel, she has to have some endurance. What's that supposed to mean? Oh my god, no! But she oh, will not stay broken, down. I've, I've read on the dirt sheets that Lamorel has about a five second endurance, if you know what I mean. Well, he's two men in one. Off the ropes. He, 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 he has another oh. man inside of him. <laughs> Toss! Ginger! Trying to fight back! Ginger. Oh. Ah. Slow to get up. This was Whitney's match from the start. Oh, God. Went for some sort of move, but she's got... gonna. I think this is over. I mean, she gave it her all. Yeah. Here comes the. Yep. Yeah. The Whitney swing! The Queen of Swing herself. What? But. Back to her feet somehow, but no. Oh, because she did a blackout. Yeah, oh, there we go. What? No, she's trying to choke her a out. Instead. sleeper. Yes, she is. Why? That's more violent than it needs to be. Just hit the total blackout and end it. Could be making a comeback here. She should have just oh, hit that just... blackout. You don't want to give Ginger a chance to rest. <laughs> okay, I can't say it. Yeah.
I mean, Ginger, she's got heart. She's keeping up with oh. her. But... Oh, right. Oh, so the table's back. The rebuilt table. Thank you, Carpenter Wally, for rebuilding that table. It's Don't always Wally up. time with Wally's carpenting. Now, Ginger, luring her back into the ring. Catch Ginger needs ass. some kind of. Oh! Wait a minute! Bitch slap! Well, she gets a slap. Get the cover! Off, cover her! That that can't really do much damage. Want her to cover after a slap duel? She hasn't had any. Oh, oh my God! Ah, oh, brain, oh, brain Buster! Sir, you couldn't really see it there. She hit it's the Brain the Buster. Oh no! Is it wrong that I thought she might actually have won there? Yes, it is. No, but I ain't a Buster. Ginger can pull. With what Nick? Whitney called retard strength, though. Nick has no idea what's oh, going on. Ah! Oh my God! Two. She did it! God! Ginger! Ginger's the women's champion. She did it! She took a licking and kept on brain bustering. She has the eye of the tiger. Is she too dumb to feel pain? Maybe! That's a valid point! My god, Whitney did everything to her but a total blackout! That might have been the mistake of the match! And she had to get out of there before Whitney got back to her feet. No, she's just throwing a fit. Oh, come on! Come on, Lamorel. Be the lady nice, she just won the match! The dude's got to prepare for his championship match. I mean, this is very disrespectful. That she's happy that she won the women's title. Okay. I agree, Ginger. Yeah. Fluff filled. Yeah. What does that even mean? A person can't have more than one dream. Wow. wow! Oh, and wow. flipped him off! <laughs> Never heard such language from Ginger! Oh! Another breakup? Ginger is breaking up with Lamorel! Uh oh. Lamorel doesn't care. He doesn't give a shit! He's got bigger fish to fry tonight. Uglier fish, too. Sure. And Seamus' career is on the line here, folks. Lucas Gomez says if the Crusade does not defeat the longest reigning champions in Jeremax history, then Sheamus must retire. Either and after Lucas has his terrible performance earlier... Either way, Lucas this wins. This wrenching soulful performance where he gave it his all. <laughs> the pressure's really on Redcorn and Sheamus here tonight. Well, there you see the Irish warrior Celtic thing. Celtic cinnamon bun Sheamus. That's it. Are you looking to hit that bro kick or the cross double butt? My favorite's the cross double butt. Lee is just so great at naming moves, isn't he? He's incredibly it's talented. Like, hold on, Seamus, taunting, and between the ropes! <laughs> Look at the power of Seamus! Are we gonna see some swinging neck breakers tonight? I can only hope so, we haven't seen one yet. Might see some with Sandwich Arm Drag in the match. He is the powerhouse of the shield. Trip. I'm surprised Evan Redcorn threatened he wasn't going to show up, but after La uh, Luke, not Lamarill, Lucas lost, he probably doesn't want to get Lucas mad. Thank you, Duel. You're welcome. The world's most dangerous Native American. But you've, got, Red you've got to think that either way, Lucas Gomez is going to win right. in this. It's true. Sheamus goes away, a WWE star is gone, or he brings the tag titles into the crusade. My god, 400 plus days! Nobody can stop the shield trip! Here comes the sandwich arm drag, the powerhouse of the group! Who needs a, who needs stain plates? Not him! He's sandwich arm drag! And his partner, as always, the legendary fifth generation superstar. Twice removed. <laughs> What's his name? Zukak Boo Goblin. <laughs> Alright. You're more mature than Blee then. I was waiting for the music to come back. Oh, nice. Very professional. 
the legendary Pooh Goblin be. Dynasty but being represented be. well tonight. The Pooh Goblin Dynasty goes back generations, but Seamus is not going to get another generation if he can't win this one. That's right. Seamus's genitals will be removed from his body. Essentially, if he loses. you don't know oh, what Lucas Lucas for the bro. He's got a clothesline for his trouble. Almost like a sandwich club. Almost clubbed him right there. Jeez. Redcord's not even in the corner to hold the tag rope. No, he's not. Watching this beat down. Does that matter? Maybe in the Jeremax? ultimate plan is. Oh, never. Lariato. It's gonna be over. Ah. Immediately, sandwich Arthur is clubbing the shit out of him. He's taking being in Japan seriously. He was trying to run away at this Whoa. point. Oh, and a diving shoulder tackle showing Biff Andreas how it's actually supposed to be done. Redcorn realizing he should probably start helping him out. Look for the There's count-out no victory the here. Seamus with the go-behind. Oh, and the German suplex misses, and a backdrop driver in the ring. Seamus back in the ring. Breaking up the... Seamus needs to focus on the That's legal fine. man here, the powerhouse. And the camera himself just needs to focus. Oh! Pile driver on the neck. And it, oh my god! Gonna look for the look to end it here. Sandwich Club! I don't believe it! Just like that! I absolutely believe it. Look at this! It's like that! And one to the back of the oh, head! Sandwich Club to the back of the head! This is just a this is worse than the and last match! And the third! Oh my god! Sandwich Club the third! Oh! What a what a Cowardice attack by Seamus. Go for desperate measures. What a WWE superstar thing to do. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Where's he going? Oh, He's just going to let him continue to get beat up. Springboard oh. misses. <laughs> well, he tried. But Evan Redcorn doesn't have much of a partner to tag in now after that vicious huh? beatdown. Whoa! Oh, Phoenix no! splash out of nowhere. But the knees got up. So much arm drag. Very great ring awareness. Evan Redcorn probably didn't train because he didn't think he'd actually be participating. He must have had a change of heart. As everyone knows, when you're laying near the ropes, just lay, lift up your knees because that's ring awareness. Oh! He has a better success rate than Biff Andreas right now on those. Look He's two for two. His oh, oh, wow! Oh. Dropkick to the back of the head. The pharmacist of the wrong, shield trip. Wrong uh, one. Well, there's a pin on the not legal. Did he not see the pin? Or the tag? Or the tag. <laughs> That too, thank you. Now they're working on Seamus again. Probably well, still upset over the time Seamus called them hypocrites and intolerant. Well, the most damage has been done to Seamus, and maybe they're just trying to single him out because he's already weaker. Evan Redcorn, this is essentially a handicap match. You can't even get a one on Zukok Poop Goblin. Halfway across the ring? No, oh, he's going to kick outside his the ring! Oh. Bulldog! Seamus had a bro kick right to the kneecap. That might have just taken out Sandwich Arm Drag. We could be even Stevens here now. As Evan Redcorn looking to go up top again! Another Phoenix Splash break oh, and no. the knees up. Ring awareness! The smartest member of the Shield Trip. He is the pharmacist of the group. Why would you tack in Seamus? He got clubbed a hundred times. Why would the Shield Trip run into each other? Communication problems? I don't know. It's not like they're going to lose now. Seamus is in. Redcorn at least can say now he tried. Maybe. Well, Seamus seemed like he wanted Sandwich Arm Drag to come back into the match. Yeah, he didn't want to be emasculated by them, and he wants to get revenge. And now we're back to the uh, original two. Oh, oh for a pro kick! That what did he talk out of? That could have been his only chance to get score oh, a victory he's, here. He's playing with the Celtic Cinnamon Bun now. Seamus wasted little time coming back into the ring and gets clubbed in the back for his trouble. We're like a damn delicatessen here tonight. A delicatessen that serves milkshakes. Uh. Sim vertical suplex! Vertical suplex! And that's true powerhouse moves. The third. Even though that's more than the third. Oh! Not the pro oh, and pushes that. them back! A star making performance for Sandwich Arm Drag here! Clock the true powerhouse of the shield trip. But there's the no road. touching that oh, one! Bro. Get in there! Get in there! What? Oh. Why did it stand? Oh! Ow. One! Ow. Clearly, Whoa. Sandwich Arm Drag drank his Diet Mountain Dew before the match. Drank his Diet the, Mountain Milkshakes? The only Dew with Dew in it. I milkshakes guess. in it. Okay. And now, the, taste of his own medicine. Diet Mountain Dew, the only mountain with milkshakes on him. And now, working on Zukok Poop Goblin over in the corner. Make sure he's not a factor. 
as both legal men are now in the ring by themselves. Oh, what? This is a bro kick. Full kick. tilt. Brogue. That's gotta be it. Oh my. Sheamus. No, Dole, it can't be it because we've already set up the swinging neckbreaker spot and it hasn't happened yet. It almost happened that. earlier. Read your notes, jeez. Seamus is weak, but he's resilient. Looking for... Cross double butt! Zukok is down! Cross double butt! This will be timely. Can Zukok get the save? Oh. My god, he did it! Seamus New tag team champions! Against all odds. Seamus' career has been saved, and the longest reigning champions in Jeremax history have come to an end. And the crusade that you mocked so often... But it's Seamus, the WWE guy, though. It's a double-edged sword. But who is he... Who is he represent? Who is he affiliated with? Who is the person that he ordered, that he takes orders from? Lucas Cross. Yes. Say that again, please. Cross double butt. Beautiful move and new tag team champions. Lucas, Lucas. Lucas Gomez. I wouldn't be surprised if Lucas made a free bird rule or something. There he is. Get on your feet, people. Lucas Gomez. Uh, no I mean, celebration yeah, it's, it's, for tonight. It's a, it's a, it's a sullen moment tonight, people. What are you oh, clapping oh, for? You change your Shut up! That is the, that is the true injustice These of this. These double standards! He's having a meltdown here tonight, folks. There you Fired. go. Oh you no! Can't do that. That's what. That's Take what the should... tag belt. Wait. Bro, oh. Well, that did nothing to Lucas Gomez. I think he might be out on his feet there. Maybe He's not. taking the tag title and leaving. A very What's admirable reign. The tag team title. We have one tag team champion now, guys. That's kind of important. Of course you guys can still stop intolerance. Stop the intolerant Seamus from leaving with one of your belts. Point. Seriously, can we, like, take the belt before he leaves? I think he's already he's gone. Dump. He was in the parking he's lot. Dump. He's gonna throw it in a trash can at SummerSlam. Oh, my. No way. No way. Is he way. coming to finish the job? He already took out one. Here comes the underboss. There's the new... The new hardcore champion. Fale is here. Now he's gonna take out the rest of the shield trip. Cause he's such a huge man. But can even this man defeat two men? zukok has got a point, it's two on one and two is greater than one. Well, I, I have a feeling that it may be two on one now. But I don't know if those numbers are gonna hold true for too much longer. Foley's got some pretty interesting friends, you know. What are you talking about? Oh, oh my. What? No way. Oh no! Don't do this! No! <laughs> do a stropper! No, he was your best friend! Why? The legendary Zukok Poop Goblin. He's telling Foley what to do! Could he have ordered the hit on Penis too? Of course he did. It's all making sense. Why? Because they were intolerant. And one more bad luck fall. Oh no! Oh no! Zuko gonna finish the job. Oh, gob splash. Why? That's why. Oh! Zuko's had enough of the shield trip. Big oh. cock folly! Big cock fall! Ah, oh, the big cock fall! The, the real, real cock and roller! It's the real cock and roller! Real cock, Zucock real cock! Poop goblin! Zucock poop goblin has turned his back on his brothers! It's real! And he's got big cock folly backing him up! It's true. I only one, only, only two people in this entire world could take out the shield trip this easy. Big cock folly. 
PG era begins, and it begins with a bang. We're living in the PG era now. The poop goblin era. Oh, that's that's low. That is a low blow. My God! I said it was a star making knife or sandwich, but instead we are now witnessing the birth of the PG era.